Let us understand two commonly confused health conditions, food allergy and food intolerance. Food allergy and intolerance affect any individual differently. Therefore, it is important to identify these conditions correctly and get the right diagnostic test done. Allergy is an IgE-mediated reaction to various allergens and starts within up to 30 minutes of contact with the allergen. Its features may include itchy skin, rashes, hives, urticaria, swelling and other skin eruptions. Sometimes allergic reactions might also include a choking sensation or respiratory symptoms like sneezing, wheezing, runny nose or rhinitis, breathlessness and cough. Please also keep in mind that these symptoms can be caused due to respiratory allergens, also known as aeroallergens. Now, let's understand about food intolerance, which is also known as food sensitivity. Food intolerance is an IgG antibody-mediated reaction and occurs only to specific foods that one is intolerant to. Its symptoms might be commonly gut-related, such as bloating, gastritis, constipation, nausea, or irritable bowel syndrome, but may also sometimes exacerbate existing chronic conditions such as migraine, autoimmune disorders, severe headaches, eczema, uncontrolled diabetes, or even thyroid disorders by increasing inflammation in the body. Unlike allergy, food intolerance symptoms can present within two hours to two days. In a nutshell, for us to understand, Food allergy is an immediate reaction that is mediated by the IgE type of antibodies, whereas food intolerance, also known as food sensitivity, is a delayed reaction that is mediated by IgG kind of antibodies. Food allergy might present with skin-related or respiratory symptoms, whereas food intolerance might be gut-related and might be related to an inflammatory reaction in the body. To summarize, detecting the foods that one is intolerant to helps to modulate one's diet in order to reduce gut inflammation and overall inflammation in the body. Different tests are available for food allergy and intolerance. Knowing the symptoms will help you in choosing the right test and your physician in reaching the right diagnosis. Be aware of the correct symptoms and choose the right tests to restore your gut health.